All right, folks, we're back. I hope you enjoyed Alicia's talk, as well as seeing some incredible examples of best in-class web stories and learning a few practical tips to help your workflow. We think you're ready to grow out and create your very first web story. It might not be the perfect web story, but it'll be a great way to familiarize yourself with the format and the tools that you have at your disposal. Be sure to check out the PDF guide that we sent over before the event for some tips and best practices for your story. And if you're not sure what to base your first web story off of, here's a quick tip. Take one of the best performing blog posts or videos and use those same assets to create a web story. Now, we don't recommend you do this for every web story, but it'll definitely help you early on learning the tools and learning more about the format. Once you're a pro with your tool of choice, you can easily start creating original storylines. Now, if you do create your own web story after the event, we'll have a special gift for you. We'll send out a form after the event where you can submit your story to us. Once we confirm the link to your web story, we'll send you a Google Web Creator swag kit. It's pretty cool if I do say so myself, as well as enter you in a raffle to win one of five Google hardware products like a Google TV with Chromecast or a Nest Mini. Today was just the first step in your journey to creating beautiful, engaging content for your website. There are a ton of other great resources we can point you to to help as you continue learning about web stories. Stories.google is your home base for learning more about the format, as well as seeing other best-in-class examples of publishers and creators who are producing for web stories. Be sure to check it out if you need a little inspiration. We also have a whole set of channels dedicated to building a community of content creators on the web. You can follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube, and you can even tune into the link on screen to check out our Storytime series, which walks you through everything you need to know about web stories. It covers way more topics than we were able to cover in today's session, so I highly recommend you checking it out. Lastly, we want to say that it's been a pleasure hosting these sessions for you all today. You should have just seen, or it should be popping up right now, uh, a survey on your screen asking you to let us know what you thought of the event. I'm going to pause for like the next 30 seconds, minute or so, uh, so that everyone can take the time to complete the survey. It's super quick, should take a uh, you know, few seconds. Uh, this is the first time we hold one of these workshops, uh, and it is obviously online. So again, apologies for the technical difficulties early on, but your feedback is invaluable to us as we learn and aim to host more of these events in the future. We greatly appreciate any comments you have, any feedback uh, about your experience today. So I'll go ahead and pause, and everybody feel free to fill out that survey. And again, reminder, if you do fill out that survey and create a story, we will, we will send you a really cool swag kit uh, with Google Web Creators branding. Cool. Uh, now that everyone has hopefully filled out their survey, and no worries, you can still fill it out after the event if you haven't done so yet. Uh, I just want to thank everyone one last time for taking the time out of your busy schedule to learn more about web stories. We're super excited to see all the amazing content you create with web stories, and we'll look forward to seeing your completed web stories in the coming weeks. Thanks, and hope everyone stays safe and has a great rest of your week.